Hello, this is Caspaloo, and welcome back to more Let's Play Sword of Mana Blind, wherein we take our sword and we kill stuff with it. Stuff like ma giant maws and whatever that thing with the mace is. Or at least I think that's a mace. Maybe it's a shield? No, no, it was a mace. And we also try to keep our pitiable bard with a bow from being killed by giant maws. Which would help if you would stand close enough to- oopsie. That is not green anymore. That is now yellow. Which would be- well, it could be this. It's not that. Uh, it could be gnome. Nope. Maybe- maybe it was the moon. Or maybe it's just lighting. Maybe it's still green. And it just looks yellow. It just looked yellow. Okay, then. Uh, no. No, I want to be Whisk. Because healing is good. Speaking of, heal, please. Uh, and these guys are... Wait. Bow. Honestly, these guys are probably not even worth fighting. Just because... Because I don't do very much damage to them. I suspect they maybe resist the earth stuff. That might be the problem. Uh, then again, Lester is using an effective weapon and he deals less damage than I do. So, you know, figure that one out. Um, yeah, I just don't know. But I do know I'm going to kill this guy if it... There. Until he's dead, is what I was going to say. And I think I'll go on this until I at least get a 20. Then I might round out Monk to 5, or I might keep on with the sword. I, I don't know. I could go either way. Or sword, rather. Is it swordsman? Is it fighter? Whatever. Oh, and it's these weird things again. Let's see. Yeah, let's just do that. And there's more over there. And more up here. And a box! Box! Oh, that's interesting. What's up here? There's... Uh, ooh, there's several turtles with maces. I may get a mace here. Which, if I had to guess, is probably a bludgeoning weapon. That would make sense. I don't have a bludgeoning weapon. Wait. I s I've been saying mace, but these are really more like flails. And don't I already have a flail? Now, I'm definitely going to get one of these weapons, but I'm pretty sure I already have a flail. Hmm. Interesting. Yep. It's, I mean, you call it a mace, but it's clearly a flail. Um, which is something I already had. Also. <laughs> also, there's a face here. If there's one face here, there's probably more. And I kind of want to see... Well, I want to kill these, actually, because they're really annoying. Then, I want to s play around with the faces in this area, because there's probably treasure or something that I can get. Sur surely, Lester won't get himself killed by a single moth, right? Right? Oi. Well, I did find treasure, but not another head. So, it might be just the one. So, I guess I'll just hit it a bunch. And if it doesn't do anything, it doesn't do anything. Wow. Just... Oh! Well, that's interesting. The air- mace, air quotes. Yeah, I did have a flail. That's what I thought. Nope, that didn't work either. Maybe it likes the f the. This is so totally. F wow, that's really slow. 
Nope, that bounced off. Let's try an arrow. Nope. Mmm. How about magic? Okay, I actually wanted to. Nope. I don't know then. I can see the little door right here. I can see the face beside it, but I can't seem to do anything to the face. Oh well, maybe maybe if I kill the last uh the last moth. Maybe that's why it's scowling at me. Nope, that didn't I don't know. I it can't be anything important though. Yeah, you know, I just decided I don't like moths. At least not these ones. These moths with confusion and possibly and possibly darkness and definitely eye lasers. Okay, well, there's a face here. The last one was angry, so... I'm guessing this one needs to be angry as well? Okay, okay, that's probably it. It would then make sense why I couldn't hit the other one. Sort of. Seriously, why is Lester so bad at everything? Does he at least have magic? Like, should I just change his, uh, his, uh, NPC setting? Let's, let's do that. More magic, Lester. Do you even have magic, Lester? I just don't even know. Uh, Lester has magic. Technically. Not very good magic. Man, why are you so bad, Lester? Just, just... I just don't know. I want to like you, dude. I really want to like you. I like bards. But you are a real letdown. Mmm... <laughs> sort of like boxes that always hurt me. Except for this one. It's an Earth coin! Woo! I don't use my coins. Yep, I was right. Angry face opens the door. Hmm. Okay, well, there's a face up there. Oh, right. Okay, let's see how much damage this deals. I, I, oh, that hit it way over there. That dealt zero damage because I actually need arrows against these. Uh, and I'm also facing the wrong way. So, if I face the not the wrong way, and then I just keep shooting this until it's dead. Both of them, I suppose, really. Oh, and then I also need to heal because Lester is almost. is just seriously, what is wrong with you, Lester? You have a freaking bow. How do you not understand to stand far enough back that they cannot hit you? The bow is the only thing you know how to do, and you can't even do it right. I mean, I can stand right in front of them and get the double hit with my bow. But all, but you know what else I have? Mo probably around twice as much HP and also the ability to heal myself. Okay, so this is on neutral. This is on neutral. That's on neutral. Okay, neutral is not it. How about angry? Okay, well that opened one door. But there's two doors. So, how about sad? That opened the other door. Uh, let's try this one first. Ooh, there's a box there. Can I reach that? Like, not, not really. Hmm. Unless I can go. Oh, I can go behind it. It's just an icon. Oh, and it's these assholes again. I guess I'll get my bow back out. Like these, I don't, I'm not even sure if I've taken any damage from these. Although Lesser sure has. They're just sort of annoying, because they take a long time to kill. Uh, I guess I've taken a little bit of damage from them, but... 
Their damage potential seems to be pretty damn low, actually. Yeah, like, oh no, that you did two damage to me with a critical hit! I'm really feeling the pain now. I see you down there. Don't think you have escaped from me. This is actually a lot more effective on the side because then I get the double hit. It doesn't seem to work all the time when I'm directly below them. Okay, that's the way out. So, where does the other way go? <coughs> and they're all closed again. Okay, I need you to be angry. 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 No, angry. Oh, hey, that opened it and also woke up the pumpkins. Who I don't really feel like fighting, to be honest. I would need to turn my weapon again and then just change it right back. Okay, this was probably worth it. I got a seed and also some steel. I don't really care about the chocolate. But the other things that I got, those were worth it. Okay, you're already sad, so that's good. Pumpkins! Okay, well that killed one. You need to be sad. I'm get- oh, you exploded. But you dropped a box, which will probably now blow up. Or at least drop a rock on- no, actually it's fine. Cool. I mean, useless, but cool. Cool that it did not, you know, blow up. It is a turn of events I can get behind. Um, <laughs> is what I'm saying. Do I want to fight these again? I mean, not really, but I will. Because I want to level up more. Because I want to see if I get anything else at higher levels, basically. I don't think I will. In fact, I'm pretty sure I won't. But I don't know for sure. Okay, like, here's the thing. I've read that there is something that happens when you hit uh, level 40 in one of the thingies. I don't know what it is or even if it actually is a thing, but I've heard that there might be a thing and I want to see if it is. So that's sort of what I'm aiming for. Of course, having said that, that's like, what? Uh, two... Well, that's quite a lot of levels away. Okay, that is actually less effective than my sword. You would think usually your bow is more effective against flyers. Not so here. Kill the moth, please, and then I will level up. Uh, after I heal Lester. He actually caps out at 110. Wow. Uh, yeah. Of course, I'm more than 20 levels away from that, so you know. You know, that, that's going to take a while. But, eh. I mean, as far as I know, I'm probably at the highest possible class otherwise, and that's the only reason I could see to do anything else anyway. Like, unless, basically, unless I wanted more magic or speed, then the Sword Master, or whatever it's called, the one I'm leveling up in is probably the best one to do anyway. This looks familiar. Grant's Castle. So many bad memories. What, you mean... Wait, wait. I just realized this. The Coliseum is in the castle. Wow. Just wow. Usually those things would be separate. <laughs> it... Well, uh, uh, about that. Like, how much do you really know about your sister? How do you think she... Why do you think she ended up in here? <laughs> ah, that's kind of mean. Um... Anywho. Hey, it's a bird! What? Oh, hey, it's the... You know, she has got to be a Mavol. Oh, 
and she has knives out. What are you doing here? My mission is to guard this castle. That is all there is to it. Guard it from whom? Miss Isabella, we don't want to fight you. Why are you making us do- she, I mean, she really isn't. But then again, you are currently the number two biggest idiot of the realm! You took that title right away from Devious. You're- who? Uh, I'm beginning to sense a theme here. You have to beat me to get by me. I mean, okay, if you really want me to beat up a woman, it's not like you'd be the fir first one, whether you're a Mavol or not. Gourmand? Madame Isabella, please do as he says. Isn't that the death guy? Yeah, that's the Grim Reaper. Apparently, apparently, wow. Apparently Dark Lord has death himself as a assistant? Well, hmm, anyway. Is he too proud to have a woman bail him out? The rest of you. Dark Lord awaits. That is, of course, assuming that you can reach him alive. Okay, he doesn't do the Kefka voice, but I'm not going to do, well, Kefka-ish, anyway. Not exactly the same, but I'm not going to do that for the simple reason that it would probably give me a coffin fit right now. Um, yeah. Oh? So, obviously, the castle is full of monsters. Well, you managed to squeak by! I'm disappointed I must postpone my feast. Yeah. <laughs> you see, that right there. Perfect example of something I'm not doing. Hmm. Anyway, in we go. And this has got a statue, yay. We're locked in! Oh no! Who could have seen this predictable event coming? Gorman's voice, Dark Lord, insisted I give you a proper welcome. He's waiting for you inside. You won't be needing a way back, will you? Probably not. This way, lemmings! I'm looking forward to devouring your souls! Surprisingly, that's not actually too hard on my throat. Any but anyway, we're gonna stop up here because save point and 20 minutes. So join me next time for stuff. Also, apparently, for Gorman feasting on my soul. So until then, this has been Chaos Blue with Let's Play Sword of Mana Blind. And have a good day. Bye. This world to be I